Well, hello everyone, this is Ron, the Hiking Ham, Alpha Alpha 8, Papa India. And it's a beautiful day here in Northwest Ohio, not a cloud in the sky, about 60 degrees. And I'm down here at what's called Farnsworth Park along the Maumee River in the background behind me. And Farnsworth Park is about uh, 20 miles southwest of Toledo. Runs along the Maumee River and uh, the Maumee River dumps out into uh, the western uh, basin of, of Lake Erie. And this park, Farnsworth Park, runs about uh, 10 miles to the southwest along what used to be the uh, Miami Erie Canal. So today we're going to take a hike uh, down along uh, the Maumee River and uh, we'll find a nice place to set up and then I'm going to show you uh, how I can run my uh, 3 amp hour bio -Eno battery off of solar power. I'll be using the Renogy Wanderer uh, solar charge controller and we'll see if we can make some contacts with my uh, SKCC buddies and maybe some parks on the air people too. A lot of history along the Maumee River and uh, way way down there you can see what used to be a, a trolley car bridge that used to cross the uh, the Maumee River and uh, connect Waterville to Bowling Green and also go all the way back up to uh, Toledo, Ohio. Uh, it's certainly fallen apart now, but it is a very uh, historic and popular bridge for people to hang out at. Okay, we're going to set up at this campsite that's right along the uh, Maumee River. Uh, take you down the steps here, see what it looks like. Yeah, great place to go camping. There's a little shelter area in here with a with a fireplace and places to sit and everything. And you can see it's right on the river, so uh, it's going to be a great place to to set up. I think I'll just set my radio up uh, right over here. Use this stone wall as my seat and uh, set up the uh, vertical buddy pole antenna. So let me get things set up and uh, we'll get started. Okay, as you can see, we got the buddy pole uh, vertical antenna installed on the uh, painter's pole. So we got the antenna going up into the air real nice. And then the counterpoise wire we have running uh, all the way over to the left here connected to one of those trees. So we're set up for, uh, for 40 uh, meters with the uh, buddy pole. And you can see on the SWR that we're about 1.5 at 7. Point 060 so the KX2 internal tuner will be able to handle the the rest of the tuning for us. Okay, we got the BioNO 28 watt uh, solar portable solar panel laid out on the ground and uh, right next to it you can see that little black box that's the uh, Renogy uh, Wanderer charge controller. Make sure if you buy one of these that you get the one that says TM after the Wanderer because that's the only one that they have that actually will charge lithium ion batteries properly. So we got the charge controller hooked up to the, the 3 amp hour bio -NO battery laying there and always hook up the battery and the charge controller before you plug in your uh, solar panel and now all we have to do next is uh, just make the connection with the uh, KX2 radio.
Okay, well, not a lot of action this afternoon. I had uh, three contacts, one with a Parks on the Air guy down in North Carolina, a, a good CW exchange with a guy down in Texas, and another CW exchange with a guy down in Maryland. And sometimes that's just the way it happens. A 40-meter band doesn't seem to be uh, 
uh, very good this afternoon. But in any case, you got a chance to see uh, how I hook up the three amp hour BioNO battery to the uh, Renogy Wanderer solar charge controller and how we use the 28 watt uh, BioNO portable uh, solar panels. So if you like what you see on uh, the Hiking Ham, click the subscribe button. And this is Ron the Hiking Ham, Alpha Alpha 8, Papa India. Until next time, 73.